And for the first time, we're hearing from the people who tried to save the life of a Las Cruces police officer in February. Anchor Sasha Leninger has that video. I saw what looked like a brawl. I didn't see the night. It's the afternoon of February 11th when Las Cruces police are called to an officer down. He just walked up and I don't know what he said, but he ran after him immediately. He ran at the officer immediately? The man just picked up his girlfriend. That's when he says he saw something suspicious at his friend's property. My friend who owns all this property was telling me that he has had problems here. If I see anybody, you know, let him know. Okay. So I did. He sees what he thinks people are breaking into it. So he parks over there and he's taking photos with his phone of them possibly breaking into over here. He's watching, 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 calls Jim, says, hey, I think they broke into your place. I'm going to keep an eye on until the police get here. He and his girlfriend also called the cops. Well, we we actually just did like a loop to see like if the officer had, had uh, responded yet. Okay. And we did. We saw he pulled up. We passed by him. My boyfriend parked right there just to keep an eye out. That's when they see Officer Jonah Hernandez walking up to 29-year-old Armando Silva and then being attacked. We have chosen to pause this video due to its graphic nature. Immediately, my boyfriend grabbed his firearm yeah. and took off running. As I was getting closer, I saw him profusely bleeding. The officer? Red everywhere. And so I was yelling on the way for him to stop, and he came running at me, so I shot him twice. He came at me, <laughs> and I saw this guy just bleeding out. I've never seen blood like that. And so I fired at him again, he fell down. I actually ran back and forth because I didn't know what to do because I didn't know whether to keep checking on him. The or... officer, okay. So I went to the officer and I saw the big gash in his neck. So I kept pressure. And by then, uh, the this guy right here rolled up and okay. he started helping me. After that, my boyfriend just was trying to like aid the officer. Mm -hmm. That's when another officer hears this. I heard scuffling on the radio. I heard a random voice key up saying that there's an officer down at this intersection. Officer Hernandez was stabbed at least one time near his neck. He died at the hospital. Silva was shot several times and killed. Sasha Leninger, KOAT Action 7 News. Officer Jonah Hernandez was 35 and is the first line of duty death for the Las Cruces Police Department. He leaves behind a wife and two sons.